from Ableton.org presents Mathematical Literacy Scales, Maps and Plans Lesson 3, The Memo Please do Lesson 3's work before you look at the memo otherwise you are just going to waste your time Ok, but here it follows um, How many learners are, are in the class if there is only one learner at a desk? Ok, so it's 15 No, the picture is not here but I know that you've done it Which learner is sitting left to learner K. So there's K, left is learner J. Which learners sit closest to the windows? This learner J and then D is not here and then also learner M. Yeah, they can touch the windows. Um, the width of the classroom, I told you that it's 10 centimeters wide. Let's quickly get a pen. It's 10 centimeters wide, so you multiply it with the 50 of the scale, which is here, 50. It gets to 525 centimeters, and if I divide 525 centimeters by 100, I get 5,25 meters. Right, the uh, length of the classroom from the blackboard to learn to here, it's 15 centimeters. If I times it by the 50, I get 750 centimeters. Divide by 100 is 7.5 meters. And lastly, the width of the teacher's desk is 4.5 centimeters. If I times it with a scale of 50, I get 225 centimeters. Divide by 100 is 2.25 meters. Okay, so now you have to explain. You sit at desk K. Okay? you want to walk from the door to K. Okay, so you can walk in through the door and turn right before B. Walk straight from down the aisle passing desks E and H on the left. At desk K behind desk H, turn around to face the blackboard and sit down at the seat. And then the last year, your friend forgets her classroom. She said, you walk in through the door you turn right after the second row of desks, so you turn right here. You walk past one, two, three, four desks. You look left over the desk next to you, so there's the desk next to you. You look left and your back is on the floor, so her back was here next to desk O. Right, and the school plan, the width of the and the length of the sports field. Now, if the sports field was printed according to the memo, the width is 50 millimeters by 100 millimeters. Now, here your answer will be different because your map is a little bit smaller. But if you use the scale, you should get that there's five segments that fits into the width of the sports field. So it's one, two, three, four, five. I'm so cheating, sorry. There are five segments that fits into the width of the sports field. So the sports field is 50 meters. This 50 meters should be the same. And then there are 10 segments that fits into the length of the sports field. So it's one, two, three, Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So the segments, there are ten that fits in there, and that means that it is hundred meters. Okay, so these answers should be the same, but they might be different because you may actually have printed this in a smaller scale. Right, then. What subject would you be teaching in A3? It's science. Which subject is taught in the classroom next to the hall that faces the sports field? It is B1. It's mathematics. At the ball hall wants to go from A1 to the duck shop. That's what printed here. Okay, so you walk out of the science room towards the sports field. You turn left and you walk along the edge of the field towards the school and the hall building. At the school hall, you turn right. At the first opportunity, you turn left before the math classroom and you walk past the math building. Then you turn right and walk straight towards the tree. At the end of the tree, you turn left 
and the tuck shop will be in the building in front of you. Okay, good explanation. Then example two, a stadium seating plan. If you wanted to book, a, uh, sorry, this is a cinema seating plan. If you wanted, where would you want to sit? Um, you can say you want to sit in L8, which is right at the back. There's L8 or L9. Um, or you want to sit in A10 right in the front. Or you want to sit in D7, whatever. Right. Are seats in 11 and in 12 available? So in 11 and 12 are booked. Um, which seats offer you in your classmates the best view? The middle section. So they say here. Yeah. Because it's not too far from the screen and it's also not too close. Because if you're sitting right at the front of the screen, you really have to stretch your neck to be able to see the movie. For if you're going to the movie with a friend in a wheelchair, name one seat where they can sit and then sit next to it where you can sit with them. If they sit here in D12, you can sit in D11. Or they can sit here and you can sit in D1. For example, friend can sit next to D1 and you can sit in D1. Or D11 is the other one because wheelchair is the, are these purple areas. Um, where will you see if you want a front view of the screen? In room row, row A. What fraction of N is booked? So in N there are 24 seats and 5 are booked. So 5 out of 24 is fully booked. What percentage of the theatre is still available? So there are 200, 234 seats. 211 is available. So you take the available seats, 211, divided by the total amount of seats, times by 190,17% or 90% is still available. And the stadium plan, um, at point X, will be standing on the field near the left-hand side goal post and category 5 seats, category 5 seats in block G of G. Um, of the south stand ramp seating. South stand ramp seating. Yeah. Okay, this um why do you think the seats are categorized? The seats are color coded and categorized by price. Another answer can also be they are categorized. They have different prices because you have a better view at certain stages at certain places. So over here if you want to see the center of the field it will be category 7. You're at the goal, the um, the blue ones. You have the best view of the field, for instance, and um, the one shade of blue. So this shade of blue, you have the best view, and that one you have not such a good view. Something like that. S describe the position of the stand that contains the most category 3. Category 3 are purple. These stands. Um, the west stand has the most category 3 seats. It's on the left of the stadium between the north stand and the south stand. Um, if you are sitting at point Y, what's the quickest way to get to the south stand ramp seating? Walk behind the east stand seating with the stadium on your right, then turn right and walk straight to the south stand stamped ramp seating. Describe the position of hot dog stand at point Z. Okay, so there's a hot dog stand. The hot dog stand at point Z is in the top left corner of the diagram. It is between the west and the north stands. Your friend is at the hot dog stand at Z. Explain to him how to find you. Um, you if you are seated in category 5, seat block A. Um, category 5 seats are orange. Okay. So it's here, block A. Um, walk behind the west stands with the stands on your left, then turn left 
at the end of the stands and walk straight to the edge of the south stand ramp seating. Walk between the south stand ramp seating and the south stand seating level 1. Pass blocks H, G, F, E, D, C and B. Block A, carry with fives on your left at the end of the south stand ramp seating. And then the width of the field is 70 meters and 144. So you first convert the meters to centimeters by multiplying with 100. So 70 meters turns into 7,000 centimeters. And you divide that by 1,000 to get 7 centimeters. So you measure with the ruler and see whether you have a, a width of 7 centimeters. The, the length is 144 meters times by a hundred you get to mm, there's an, a naught missing mm, so it should actually be one for for naught naught so it should be fourteen thousand four hundred and if you divide it by a thousand you knock off three naught so it's one Two, three, and this is actually correct. It's 14,4 centimeters. Okay, so measure where they have 14,4 centimeters. And that is the lesson for today. Thank you very much.